Iraq Stock Exchange On Thursday, the Iraqi Securities Commission ISC announced the conclusion of an agreement with the International Finance Organization to develop the Iraqi market, and while it indicated the preparation of a guidebook to increase the transparency of companies, it confirmed that the new website of the Iraqi Stock Exchange will cover spot stock prices and is considered a qualitative leap. INA Four cross-transactions occurred on 21.0 BN shares of Trans-Iraq Bank BTRI on October 7, October 8, October 9, and October 10, valued at IQD 10.3 BN and corresponding to 7.9% of BTRI's capital. The procedures for listing Al Sanam Islamic Bank BSAN on the ODC platform with its capital of IQD 300 BN have been completed based on the instructions of the Securities Commission. The process of creating share certificates for the company's shareholders began on October 6. Trading will be launched after depositing 5% of the capital, or after 21 days from the depositing start date. Following the ISX letter on October 9, ISX decided to continue the suspension of trading of Union Bank BUOI until the bank provides the AGM minutes for the meeting scheduled to take place on October 12. Bain Al Narain Investment VMES will hold its AGM on November 7 to discuss and approve 2022 and 2023 annual financial statements, dividend distribution and the decision of the CBI to withdraw the license and liquidate the company. The company had already been suspended from trading by ISX on August 26 due to their failure to meet the requirements for maintaining a license. Stocks that resumed will resume trading, Iraq nor Islamic Bank Bini resumed trading on October 6 after holding its AGM on September 29 in which they discussed and approved 2023 annual financial statements and electing seven original and seven alternative board members. New shares of Sahin Bank for Islamic and Finance BCIH from the capital increase through a 16.4% rights issue to IQD 355.0 BN resumed trading on October 6. Original shares of Commercial Islamic Bank of Iraq BCOI resumed trading on October 8 after holding its AGM on September 27 in which they discussed and approved 2023 annual financial statements, increasing the paid-in capital from IQD 250.0 BN to IQD 292.5 BN through a 17% bonus issue, and electing three alternative board members. Al Mustashar Islamic Bank BMUI resumed trading on October 10 after holding its AGM on October 4 in which they discussed and approved 2023 annual financial statements and electing seven original and seven alternative board members. Stocks that were suspended will be suspended from trading. ISX suspended trading of the Light Industries ITLI starting October 7 due to the AGM that will be held on October 10 to discuss and approve 2017 and 2018 annual financial statements, the removal of mining activity from the commercial register, and electing four original and four alternative board members. ISX suspended trading of Sumer Commercial Bank BSUC starting October 8 due to the AGM that will be held on October 11 to discuss and approve 2023 annual financial statements. ISX suspended trading of Iraqi Agricultural Products Marketing Meet AIPM starting October 9 due to the AGM that will be held on October 14 to discuss and approve electing four original and four alternative board members. ISX suspended trading of Amin al-Iraq Islamic Bank BAME starting October 10 due to the AGM that will be held on October 15 to discuss and approve 2023 annual financial statements, dividend distribution and increasing the paid-in capital from IQD 250.0 BN to IQD 350.0 BN through 40.0% rights issue. The bank adjusted its decision to increase the capital from IQD 250BN to IQD 300BN which was decided in its AGM held on November 30, 2023.
ISX will suspend trading of Iraqi date processing and marketing IIDP starting October 22 due to the AGM that will be held on October 26 to discuss and approve 2020, 2021 and 2022 annual financial statements and electing five original and five alternative board members. ISX will suspend trading of National Chemical and Plastic Industries INCP starting October 29 due to the AGM that will be held on November 3 to discuss and approve electing four original and four alternative board members.